belonging can be defined as the ha uh, happiness felt in secure relationship. Relationships are essential component of life. A sense of belonging coupled with the needs of interpersonal relationship motivates uh, behaviors such as friendship, trust, acceptance, love, significance, and affiliation. Human beings are uh, so, uh, social creatures, and we interact with each other um, on three basic levels, which is spiritual, solical, and physical. Um, our sense of belonging is intertwined with the sense of purpose. We belong for a reason. As such, I firmly believe that the sound sense of belonging can only be effectively achieved through the process of self-discovery. Um, we belong to the city of Toronto. We make the city of Toronto. Our ideas, purpose, understanding of self, concept of the resource, relationship with the source, all come together to shape our purpose belonging to our city, Toronto. Uh, there's no such thing as a better city. We have to become better people to create the better city because um, every undiscovered precious gem, gold, diamonds, um, is still valuable and everything unknown or undiscovered still exists. So is every one of us in a city is as valuable with the gifts that we possess. Uh, the amazing pheno phenomenon is that we don't give ourselves the gifts and the talents that we have uh, or we possess. So it's highly important to understand and know why you possess the gifts that you have so we can contribute to the city our dear city effectively. Um, every city can be compared to a fertile terrain that has, been, that has potential to produce uh, lustrous vegetation if the right seed is planted and cultivated. Our gifts, our talent are the seeds uh, that need to be planted on this fertile terrain for germination to, to take place. Toronto is no different uh, if we will to discover the truth about ourselves, our purpose, our gift, our talent, invest them in this city, uh, our beloved city, we will automatically become the fertile Toronto to which we all belong. The challenge, however, is that there are many latent and unrecognized purpose that are yet to be discovered. If we, the people of our beloved city, take the time and unearth our abilities and invest in understanding the purpose behind our gifts, we will be able to significantly contribute to the city that we live in. Uh, to my fellow artists and designers, I believe there's a few of us here, um, we, can, we must own the city. We must be of the conviction that we have a responsibility to lead the great the general masses into a greater and brighter future. We are the visionaries who must adhere to the persuasion that we will always be relevant in the future. This relevance will only be achieved and sustained as we endeavor to be a service to humanity or a service to the city of Toronto. We must understand that whatever we design must have the capacity to influence the conditions and the environment that determines the destiny of our beloved city, Toronto. To achieve this, we, we as the people must have the willing to answer the following five questions that I'm gonna leave with you. These questions, these five questions are the foundation of our human experience, socially, economically, spiritually, our sense of significance, and are also the provocation of all our behaviors. Until we can comprehensively um, answer these questions, we will be unable to truly achieve the sense of belonging and as ascribe true meaning to our city. These questions are not to be answered today uh, or at this time. They are intended to usher us into a space of introspection and reflection as we contemplate becoming the best of ourselves, the best community, and ultimately the best city. These questions address the five important discovery in human experience, which are identity, heritage, purpose, potential, and destiny. Uh, the first question is, who am I? That deals with identity. Uh, the second question is, where am I from? That deals with source and heritage. Um, her source gives you value, 
for example, the strength of this material depends on where it was extracted from. What can I do with this with the potential, our potential? And um, I, strongly, I strongly believe that to, for us to die with the gift that we have is, is an act of in, irresponsibility. And um, I heard this statement that troubled me, that the cemetery is the most richest place on earth because there are many potentials that died. Uh, there are many books that were never written, many histories, uh, many stories that were never told, many arts that were never painted. And um, so our potential has to be, we have to create an environment for the potential that's in, in us, the city of Toronto, to come out. And the last question is, uh, um, where are we going that deals with the future? Um, in answering these questions truthfully, we will be able to contribute, we will be able to discover ourselves, and only then we will be able to truly um, have the sense of belonging. Until we can answer these questions, we are somebody else. Thank you.